Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be talking about how to send channels to a P16. So a P16 is a personal monitoring system that a lot of people use in conjunction with these X32s and M32s. They're ways to have in-ears, so you don't have to listen to a fallback on stage, but you can actually listen to it through a P16 unit straight into your in-ears. So one of the things that's great to know is how to send channels to the P16. A P16 has 16 channels and you get to choose which ones from the desk you send to it. So we're going to go over here to this button routing. We're going to use this tab button to scroll over to this one here that says alternate, alternate. Some of them say P16 out. This one here says alternate P16 output. It's really, really simple. It has 16 outputs here, and you simply just get to choose what one of those 16, or which of those 16 outputs connects up to which instruments, which channels. So here we go, channel one, and I'm just using my scroller here, channel one, and I can go over here where it says output signal and choose what one is going to channel one on the P16. So here we go, I can see that it's it's direct out, it's channel one, which is vocal one. I could change that to vocal two, three, four, or we've got them here. Vocal one, two, three, four, five, six is one to six. So I could choose vocal six by pressing direct out six. And you'll see there that vocal six is now going to the first channel of the P16. I can do that with direct outs, or I can do it with the talkback mic, I can do it even with our buses. So it might be that I've set up a tom bus like this. The tom bus includes the high tom and the low tom, and even maybe the mid tom. So I can put all of those toms together, that's bus five, onto that P16. So that first channel is gonna have all the toms that are in the bus going to that first channel. So the last thing is I can do is I can choose this here, which is tap points, where I can choose whether the signal going to the P16 is pre-EQ, meaning before any EQ has been done to it, or post-EQ, meaning after all the EQ work's been done to it. So pre-EQ is a pretty safe one. It means that the person on stage is hearing their instrument without anything being processed on the desk. And you can see here, as I scroll through all of these, these are all pre-EQ really. Oh, V2, yeah, as I scroll through these, sorry. One of them here, the click, most of them are pre-EQ. So that for now is P16 routing.